Welcome back everyone, bit more everybody's golf on PS4. Special Tournament 43, Finding Massimo 2. Um, we're going to play Imperial Garden with the Mega Cups. Uh, and look, there he is, Massimo, with his dark shades on and his leather jacket haunting me. Um, so let's go. Uh, we're going to go Grass Cutter. Let's get clicking. Time to move. Not because I'm anticipating going into the, um, the thick green stuff, but you know these things happen so we're still three away from clearing this gallery <sighs> it's beginning to kind of you know get to me feeling the pressure um i've been spending a lot of credit shuffling the gallery participants um but you can you know get get one at a time max there's no way i'm gonna get all three or i don't have the patience or the coins to sit there and just keep shuffling it it'd be quite nice if you could just pay a bunch of coins and get them lined up but I suppose um, the game designers want you, to, want you to keep coming back. And guess what? It's got me coming back. So, Imperial Garden, again, interesting course. All about getting good position on the fairway. Um, and fairways and greens. Okay. It's a par four. So, hold ten. Again, there's a weak wind, so I'm probably pretty safe I'm trying to run that up there. Yeah! Oh, nice shot! That's not so bad. Just get up on that little last bit. So 90 to go. Tiny bit of wind into my face. Not a lot of green to work with. But not really very uphill because it's front edge I kind of do need just a little bit yeah that was always the worry pitches on that slope and just dies on me and I haven't got um, tornado cups to bail me out okay can we chip it in oh yeah mega cups helps though <laughs> I'll tell you that. So where's Massimo? Where are you, Massimo? Oh, he's at evens. Okay. Because let's be honest, this isn't about the win. This is this is about Massimo. Okay, so this is the mirror of the last time I played it. So again, I can reasonably safe, I think, playing it. Playing it around this way. But I'll just try and hook it a tiny bit. Just to kind of bring it round. That's all right. And with the wind, it takes a lot of the a lot of the aggression out of this course. Oh, that pin position now again. Eesh. Okay, this is all about where it pitches. Yeah, see the, d the difference there is just a tiny bit more green to work with. Oh, for the eagle! Okay, so... The wider cups kind of help here. Gives you that bit of margin for error! And I pretty much needed all of it! But hey, I'll take the eagle. So it gets me to three under. Our boy Massimo's at one under. So two ahead of him. It's a powerful. Okay, this is that dog leg. Hmm. Now with the weak wind, the skip's definitely on. I don't think I want the power shot though, because I'm just not convinced. Ah, oh, let's, let's let's go for it. I'm gonna just give it a bit of hook, just because I'm not entirely convinced I'd clear that tree. Oh, I actually didn't need the skip in the end. Ah, and of course, yeah. Then I go in the water. Handy. I'll take the drop. So yeah, I think if I'd have pitched in the water there, that would have killed enough of its momentum. But hey, you live and you learn. So a birdie's going to be a struggle here. I mean, I'll, oh, that's far too far. I'll take the par to be fair. 
Okay. Yes, the mistake there was the skip. But I've got the water skip. That would have, would have killed enough of it. I suppose I could have gone with them um, without the power shot, and that might have been better. Yeah. So again, this is this is where it chokes up into here like this. I oh, just need just need a good bounce here. This is all about where it pitches. Oh, and that might have just yeah just pitched in the right spot. So it gives me an approach at least. Okay, now I've got a bit of green to play with here. It's slightly uphill. Just want, just want to knock it past and stun it. Didn't get the backspin. Yeah, but I'm a bit short. Okay, so this is going to be right edge. Right edge and firm. It's a bit more borrow there than I thought it was. Oh, we got the birdie. Four under. After four. Where's our boy Massimo? Our Massimo's two under. So two shots ahead. Oh, 14. It's a par three. It's a par three, so it's not a horrible pin, but of course that there's that bunker in front. So we might try and come in right to left. wasn't great there. Oh, That's Sandy. Yeah. Oh, and it's... <sighs> Dreadful. It's not even out, is it? Look at the gauge closely. Oh, it's probably playable, though. Again, it's, it's all about position. If I'd have put that in the right spot, we wouldn't be taking a double bogey. I needed to club up there, didn't I? It was at the end of the range. <sighs> okay, two and it puts me love with Massimo. Massimo's beginning to take on the, um, the role of Nemesis. Now, do I think I can get it over that? I don't think I can, if I'm honest. Yeah, let's club down and go for this bit. Bravo. Better clear the sand! Ah, oh, and it's just going to roll left into that bunker, isn't it? Hold up, hold up, hold up, hold up, hold up, hold up. That's a harsh penalty, isn't it? Well, I've nearly powered my three wood up at least. Okay. Oh, good shot. Oh, where is this one going to end up? Oh, that's not bad. Go on. Chance for a birdie. Chance for a birdie. That's okay. Nice birdie. Oh, that's the way. Oh, so Massimo's ahead of us because he got an eagle. Oh, 16. It's a par five. Oh, Massimo. Okay, so we've played this strat before. Oh, we've gone for this. We've gone for this skip. We might try it again. What I'm trying to do is land it on that, on that asphalt, basically. And you get a big old bounce. There you go. 
Oh yeah, you just call it lucky. I call it played for. Still if you're 283, mind you. And it's and it's pretty hairy 283. And stopping it is is 90% of the battle. Oh this is just never in contention. I think it's the altitude that gets you there. Plus the height difference. Jeez. Holy, holy, holy moly. Let's just get it up on the green. And we'll deal with it from there. Okay, let's have it in the rough. Oh, it's chipping Bokey. Okay. Well, I think we're not going to take Massimo in this, are we? Where's he at? He got a he got a Bokey too. Oh, seventeen. It's a par three. We're going to be coming back for Massimo, aren't we? Okay, so one sixty-three, slightly downhill. Okay, we've got the backspin this time. See if we can stop it. Maybe I need the super backspin ball. Just to get a bit more control over these. Oh, really like let's, let's go a cup left. And let's hit it firm. Uh, that was about right, yeah. But the big cups trick you into thinking you've you've got lots of margin there, and I just don't think you have. I think you've still gotta be you've still gotta be pretty precise. So eighteen. Okay, again, I'm going to try and just bring this right to left. Not really good, just the... It avoids just clipping the corner. That's okay. So that leaves me 123. Again, not a lot to work with. Just not a lot to work with at all. That's uphill. It's on the green at least. That was kind of pin high. So it's going to break. So let's let's go about let's go about two cups. Let's be quite. Oh, that's probably too firm. That's okay. That's okay. So that gets me to four under. Um, Massimo's going to be two or three, isn't he? Yeah, Massimo ended up three under. Well, I got second. But again, you take that. You take the double bogey out. I've got him. I've just got to cut those big mistakes out. That's the solution. The big mistake cost me. Well, oh, I've not played that. Oh. Anyway, do I get some stuff? Coins, gems. Okay, I'll take it. Okay, so that's that. Um, yeah, look at him. There you go, look, Massimo. My nemesis. So we'll be back. We'll be back for Massimo soon. Um, please subscribe. I've got a golf story um, set of videos running, which no one appears to be watching. Um, please give it a look. Um, and let me know if you like it. Leave a comment and subscribe. I'll speak to you next.